Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Ryan Ride Mechanic channel. This is going to be a really quick video, so let's just get right into what I've got going on. Now get ready. Here we go. As you've probably seen with some other channels, we've had some, uh, some movement on Top Thrills 2. I was looking into it myself, and I happen to have some viewers at the park today. And I uh, was talking with them about the trains, and they said, no, they're still sitting there. And I was saying, oh, this and that. And they're like, they sent me a picture. And they said, look, the wheels are going on. And I was looked at the picture, and I was like, oh, yeah, look at that. Those wheels are going on. That is absolutely awesome. And then I was like, wait a minute. Hey, those are new wheel carriers. And then I came back here and I was like, let me, let me look into this, hold on. And I got up the picture and I'm like, okay, so here's the train right here sitting there. We zoom in and I zoom in a little bit further and I go over and I'm like, that doesn't look like much on that. This one's kind of grainy, but if I go to another image, I've actually already brought up the comparison. Watch this. Okay, so what we're looking at here is this was from a thumbnail off of another video. This was the original Top Thrill 2 wheel carrier design and wheel. And down here is the new Top Thrill 2 and wheel carrier design. Uh, so what I'm looking at is that it looks like the wheels look to be the same. Okay, not much change there, which is fine. No big deal. But it looks like right here, you see how underneath where this, uh, where these road wheel support spars join to the carrier? See how there's a big open pocket right there? And then down here, there's this webbing that's been installed. So this looks like, but you can see the center shape. See that spine is still there. It's still there on this bottom one as well. But you can see all that stuff looks the same. Everything else looks to be the same. So it looks like what they've done is they've added some reinforcements in here, probably going from the top of this road wheel spar down to the guide wheel assembly. And although I can't see it on this other picture, I'm wondering if it's also underneath down to the up stop. Basically what they did is they conical shaped the, uh, the inside of the, the wheel carrier assembly. So that stress can go around underneath there. So it looks like we have, we can see a modification on the wheel carrier, which is absolutely awesome. So that's pointing a little bit. I'm not saying it's the problem. I don't, don't know for sure, but I'm just saying that points a little bit at they were having some stress in that area. So they removed all the wheels and they removed the wheel carriers. And it looks like one or more new wheel carriers have showed up modified being that they're all one piece billet, um, you wouldn't typically do something like weld onto those. That's typically like you, you don't realign the grain structure inside a billet material by welding on it. You can do it, but it's not great. It, it affects the material. So if that is in fact a new design, which it looks like it is, uh, basically they would have remanufactured those at the factory and then shipped these out. This must have been part of that shipment that arrived. Um, the other minor things we can't see right now, which would be the wheel carrier, the, the legs that come out here to hold the road wheels, did they increase the thickness of those at all? Although we can see these reinforcement plates down here, we can't see if that material, you know, from the side, if you're looking at it straight on, did that, in, did that material thickness increase at all that way? I don't know. But I got these pictures and I real quick, I'm like, this is really cool. I want to I wanna put this out there real quick if anybody hasn't seen it. So let me know what you think. Maybe I'm just full of it and I'm looking at something that's always been there. I've done that before. I have no problem saying that. Um, but what do you think? Is this, is this a new design and uh, people that maybe heading to the park with some of those cameras that can zoom in like, you know, to the surface of the moon. I know you're out there. Uh, take some uh, close-up pictures and send them out there. Let me know what you, what you see. You can always email me at ryanthereidemechanic at yahoo.com. Um, if you're just stopping in for the first time and like this sort of stuff and what I do, 
make sure you give it a thumbs up, like, and subscribe. Do all the normal things down there. It helps me out. I know this is really quick. I know, like my shortest video ever. So we'll just end it by saying, stay off the air gates.